Well, what's up everybody? Hope you're all doing great. Um, in the next few minutes, we'll take a quick look at uh, Shiba Inu. Abbreviation, uh, abbreviation ship, but I, <laughs> I think you all know that. Uh, so yeah, Shiba Inu has had some uh, nice bullish days. Uh, let's see, from the bottom we're up 27%, so that's nice. Uh, but to be honest, it's it's too er too early to uh, to be happy right now. Um, it's nearing uh, quite a strong resistance area at uh, 3330 uh, right here, together with uh, or the 200 EMA together with a FIB uh, at a normal key level. So I think it's going to be extremely hard already to get through that area. Um, and even when it does, I uh, I will see ship. I, I will only see uh, Shiba Inu as bullish if it really breaks this uh, 36 34 level. Uh, if we do manage to break that, then well. We do have a shot, um, you know, then we at least consolidate a little bit higher. So uh, if we consolidate higher, obviously that um, increases the chance that we have bigger bull runs or at least bull runs closer to the all time high. Uh, so that would be great. Um, in my opinion, a real signal of a bull run or a very strong uptrend, which uh, probably needs to happen with shape. It, it, it can happen. Um, I just think it's very unlikely that it will happen right now. In my opinion, then um, for a meme coin like Shiba Inu to really uh, to really go up in price, we need a bullish market. Um, and as of right now, Bitcoin is nearing 44,000 again, uh, but it's not near it. And, you know, we are looking bullish, but I don't think as of right now, Shiba Inu can get into a big bull run or a strong uptrend, which, as I said, I think it needs. Uh, so... As long as we don't uh, breach this 4,000 level, uh, we're just going to be at least consolidating. Um, and to be honest, as I said, we're nearing a strong resistance here. So if we if we get a strong touch off of that, a strong retracement off of that, then I even think it's quite likely that we drop down to 2,800 again. Um, and I'm not saying that would be the last support. I mean, we might even drop down to 2,400 again, but I definitely do think that that 2,800 will, will hold at least for some time, a couple of days. Um, doesn't necessarily have to retrace to 2800 uh, immediately after uh, retracing from this area. We might also consolidate a little bit between uh, 3000 and this uh, level at 3300. Uh, but then uh, I just think it's inevitable that we drop down to, uh, to 2800 in a couple of days. And as I said, from there, we might support for, for a couple of days more. Um, but it also kind of depends on the whole state of the crypto market. I mean, if the whole crypto market becomes more bullish, that increases the chance of us breaking 3300 uh, and trying out 3600. If it's really bearish, then obviously we're going down to the uh, 2400s again. Uh, so yeah, that's basically my analysis on Shiba Inu. Uh, as I said, I just... Shiba uh, ship might have a, a nice bull run. I mean, there's nothing to say, <laughs> nothing to say against it, but I don't think this is the time. Um, or some really big cataclysmic event must happen, but um, I don't think that's likely. Uh, so yeah, that's basically my analysis on Shiba Inu. Uh, if you have any questions about this analysis, please let me know down in the comments. As always, this is not financial advice. It's just my opinion based on a technical analysis. But having said that, thank you all for watching and listening and I hope to see you all in my next videos. Bye.